Hello, hello, hello. This is Asif Iqbal and you are watching Haro Tech. In this video, we are going to fix five issues most commonly faced ESP32 issues. Two related to installation and three related to uh, ESP32 not connecting to Wi-Fi. Coming up next. Take care. So first step is check settings, we will go to files and then preferences. You have to click this compile but, uh, checkbox and upload checkbox. There you should have this setting. This is very important, please note that you have to add this JSON file. After that we will go to board manager to add the ESP32 board. This is step 2 installing ESP32 board. So here I will type ESP32 as I have already installed. So I don't need to install it again. Make sure that you uh, first put the, the JSON file and then you uh, type ESP32 and whatever the first um, board is you install that. So after that we are gonna uh, open up the blink code and we modify it for the ESP32 we put it here too because this is a built-in LED for ESP32 and why we are doing this so that we are we make sure that the libraries have been installed perfectly so if it, it is compiled successfully it means that you have uh, uh, installed the libraries perfectly so the next step will be we will upload it and see that if uh, LED is blinking on the ESP32, then mm, we have done all the right things. So you have to select the board and then you select here port. And after, that, after selecting the port, you just hit upload. And this blink code will upload to the uh, ESP32. Now let's discuss Wi-Fi connection issues. So the first issue that you will be facing that uh, ESP32 will not be connecting to uh, your Wi-Fi. So let's create a mobile hotspot. So we are so that we are sure that it will be connected to this. So create here a Python and one two three four five six. I have created a mobile hotspot from my laptop, and it will share the internet that is coming to my inter uh, laptop. So why we have created it? So that we are sure there is no space in the SSID and password of the Wi-Fi that we are trying to connect. If you have done this step correctly, then you can see on your mobile or any other device that this Wi-Fi signal are. So we are gonna scan now the available Wi-Fi networks. This code is available in the video description. We have set up the serial monitor, so all the networks will be printed on serial monitor. Here you can see a few settings. This Wi-Fi STA setting is important. Don't forget that. You just copy this code and compile it on your side and then upload to ESP32. It will print all the available Wi-Fi. So you make uh, in this way you make sure that in, uh, the Wi-Fi that you are trying to connect is detected by ESP32 successfully. So I have compiled the code and now uh, after selecting the code I will upload to ESP32. Then you can find all the available Wi-Fi networks. So after making sure this step we move to the next step that in which we will connect to a Wi-Fi. So this is a tested code you, uh, you can uh, get it in the video description so I'm gonna copy this and I will paste it here and compile it I have just saved it you can see, see here and I have compiled for ESP32 uh, here I will click compile and before compiling you can see that I have typed here python this is the Wi-Fi hotspot that I generated from my laptop so this is the best way to rectify the issue. There is no space in the SSID and password and I have created the hotspot. Make sure that it is 2.4 GHz. And after that, 
I have put those credentials here which are which can be seen in my laptop mobile hotspot and I have turned on the mobile hotspot after that one few uh, uh, one more important setting is this so you don't have to worry about this because I have already put it into the code you just copy the code compile it on your site and upload to the uh, ESP32 it will uh, start printing uh, IP address on serial monitor and you can when you will go to that uh, IP address you will see a page web page saying that some random thing I, I think that I said mm, I have printed that uh, time on display and things like that so thank you for watching